It's National Voter Registration Day. That's why one area high school is making sure students are ready to do their civic duty in November. News 4's Jacqueline Lambert went to the school. She joins us live now in studio. So Jacqueline, what can you tell us? Kinsley, as part of Carroll High School's Adulting Day, seniors learned about voting. With some seniors being able to vote in the upcoming election, the school is helping them understand the process and why it matters. Seniors at Carroll High School learned about responsibilities adults have. One of those responsibilities include voting. And so we wanted to focus on voting registration because it is going to be uh, in November. We're going to have our presidential election. Students got to learn what an absentee ballot is and what to expect on a voting ballot. Civics teacher Danica Powell knows all too well the value of talking to students about voting. Um, and so it's very important to me to show them how to be a good citizen, how to register to vote, what that means, what that entails, that their voice does count and it does matter. Seniors who are already 18 or older will register to vote this week. Other students will get the chance to prepare for the real world as well. This week, the school held a mock voter registration drive for the upcoming mock election the school's history department will host. That's, that's our job as educators to show them this is our platform. This is literally our classroom to teach them and educate them and what this looks like. And so when they get into the practice of doing it, it's not as a scary process for them. That mock election will be held the Monday before November 5th. AP government and politics students will count the votes and announce results the next day. Kinsley? Jacqueline Lambert, thank you. The students also learned about voting for local elected positions. One example the students discussed is City Council President Brenda Simachek, who is the band director at the high school.